Hello guys, it's me, Akis. So pretty much, if you don't know yet, me and Jackson has uh, shared a partnership in this um, YouTube account. And uh, um, uh, I make sure you like and subscribe if you like the video. Let's begin. Today, the game we're playing is Fallout Shelter. Um, a game based off the um, franchise Fallout. And um, the Fallout series is a good game to play. Except Fallout 76. Anyways, and today we're going to get into this game. Um, I already created a vault, um, but this time I'm I'm going to start new. Um, it with with you guys. <sighs> now you have to determine the idea of your vault. Choose carefully because once you select an idea, it can't be changed. Yeah, make sure you do that. I'll do I'll do this number, okay? So, create a vault. Congratulations, the vault deck has selected you to be overseer of Vault 953. The vault keeps people safe from the dangers of the wasteland. As overseer, your job is to expand and maintain the vault while keeping your dwellers safe and happy. Each room has a special attribute it uses. The side dwellers will the best special to make them happy and produce extra resources. Vault Tag will give you a daily um, rating based on your performance. Remember to keep your dwellers happy and you do a great job. Oh yeah, it's gonna be a side um, campaign um, if you guys want more. Anyways. And by do Bob I'm making another campaign of System Shock, an old game um that that was the pretty much the prototype of the game Bioshock. If you don't know those two games, they're pro they're worth playing, and that you should. And the, how to find this game is that you can uh, download it on Steam. So it looks like we're loading in, but yeah. Hmm. Looks like we're getting in. Welcome to your new vault uh, overseer. Let's introduce you to the basic concepts. I already know how to do this, but I'm just going to play along with it. Power generator. It pretty much unpowers your vault. Um, you can place an armor, but I find it's not to place it here. It can do some serious damage when raiders come. And yes, raiders will come to your vault on a daily basis. So I suggest I um, choose it down here. No. Okay. The dwells will come and help um produce the vault and happiness. So pretty much you um you pick it up, um drag them like this, and then um you can see the special stats and um. And see right here on the top, it, it that it, the S is strength, and that's the number of how good the strength is. And this room in the energy room um, requires strength, so he is a good touch to the um uh, the room. And and look, seems like she is all also um a regular standard basis on the power generator as well. But but yeah. Oh yeah, this is the first recording I've ever done um, with voice, and yeah, sorry if, if I have it, if any of the other game videos I did um, didn't have voice, it's just I didn't know how to do it until I found out now, but yeah, and the dwellers will be working with the power of the supply that's up here, and this is food and that's water, and yeah, pretty much that. Oh, so pretty much this is the part where I I've never always um uh, know how to do pretty much. And 
Anyways, so now the drillers are working in the room and start um, producing reviews. Double click on the room to get closer work. You're in a dire need of extra resources. You can rush both and, cl um, and click them. This rush right here is how much it takes if you do it regularly. Then activate. And yeah, that's how you do it. And now the second room it will be a food um, shelter so it can produce food. I, I advise if you click on this side, do not click there because you can actually build another energy room there and they'll both connect. Uh, I mean, can you, and then you can put more workers in there and produce more and go faster. So I always um, tend to um, make them down here. Oh, hey Jackson. Oh man, and here is the career of, of the of the YouTube account himself, Jackson. And yeah, now on to the um uh, on to the game. Well, I'm now going to start to build a war supply, and I think I should be doing it here because um uh, well you know just the uh, um a kid from safe from raiders. Great work. Here's some food. And water to start your vault. Look at the meters to keep track of the resources needs. Look more dwellers have shown up at the vault door. Now you know the base rules over so to keep expanding your vault. Just remember to keep your dogs alive and happy. Good luck. And yes, as I said, this game can be found on Steam. And you um, but I never. Kn but there's also a place called Steam Unlock where you can get games that were that cost money on Steam. But it, but Steam Unlock doesn't got all the games. So let's tell you that. Anyways, so we're gonna stop bringing our our vault dwellers. Hmm. Sh okay, she's a regular standard. I put her here. Okay. Now now it just seems like a little prejudice because I'm um, back then. All women work in the kitchens. <laughs> Anyways, so pretty much that guy doesn't doesn't really fit there. There, yeah. he doesn't really got on um, much charisma. I'll send him here for now. Maybe he could guard the vault door against raiders. And yes, raiders will come. Anyways, hmm. <laughs> Huh. She tend the works here, but I'll set her here. She has good charisma, and charisma can help on um, produce more um babies, or which kids, and that they can turn into future vault dwellers. Wait a minute. Oh yeah, the agility works for the um for the kitchens and stuff like here, and uh, since it, she's agility five, that is good, very good. And now this guy, some bald head. Huh. Anyways, now we set him to, to, and perception also works for the war resource. And this is good. Okay. Now that our bolt has started at, at um, a good, um, good notice, um, I'll see it here and in, in this video. Goodbye, guys, and make sure to like and subscribe. And there is another person coming, but but we'll um get to that in the next video. Goodbye.